going to Vegas. I'm in my new car. Alex is in no rush. Help. It's gonna look good. It's gonna be, it's fine. It's gonna be fine. If I had one word to describe Lexi, I think it would be chaotic. Yeah, chaotic. Where's the, oh my God. She's moving out. I'm moving out, but I'm literally gonna be back in a week. I'm not moving out. It's temporary. It's half time. This is concerning. Lexi's like spiraling. I'm spiraling. I'm like, I'm like, it was not my idea. This was Alex's idea. Alex, show some emotion. Alex told me though that he's gonna, when he gets rich, the first thing he's gonna do is pay out my lease so that I can live here. <laughs> so stay tuned. Like that. I like that. Stay tuned. Next year, like, she's not gonna have another place. So. No, yeah, exactly. But it's like, it's like Please divorced parents. Yeah. She says she's coming back. Did you leave anything she, important yes. here? There's so much important thing. I love. Okay. My she docs that, I, that you gave me, your docs. I'm like, I left all my favorite flannel of yours. I left all those clothes. And I'm going to bring back. If you left boy twice. I know what you're telling the truth. Okay, guys. See you soon. Bye. <laughs> oh, my God. She never touches me. <laughs> the vlog camera's like, don't look at my face. <laughs> or don't look at my face. Oh, my God. You're hugging me too much. <laughs> It's okay, I'm gonna be back. Bye, I love you. Love you. Love you. <laughs> now what do we do? Right. Time to keep myself busy until Morgan comes back. Eventually. Just make sure you shake it well before you use it. Don't put too much on your elbows, knees, or knuckles. I go down the side, like where the muscle would be, like that indent, and then I like spread it out over the rest of the leg because I like to like create a little bit of a contour or like toning. I'll always do a second layer on the inside of the thigh because like I said, it's like, it, the tan doesn't hold as well there for me, I don't think. Also, this is my first time self-tanning in a while because you guys know I had that rash and I couldn't really put anything on my body. Okay, I'm gonna finish the rest of my body. I'll show you guys what it looks like when I'm done. I'm also filming at real, so that's why this might be confusing. I am gonna try putting tanning mousse on my face with a foundation brush and I'm gonna see if it naturally contours my face. Using the darkest one from B10, maybe not. Yeah, it's insanely dark. It says insanely dark. Here we go. I'm like terrified. Oh. Oh. Oh my god, it's like dropping. I think you're supposed to like go and like uh, like that. Wait, I'm totally defeating the purpose now of contouring. I need to like get my eyelids low, right? Oh, help. It's gonna look good. It's gonna be, it's fine. It's gonna be fine. I think I should like put it like here too. Right? Should get some on the ears too, right? I look like I dipped my face in powdered bronzer or rolled in the dirt. I've loved this stuff on my body before, so I feel like I'm gonna look so sunkissed after, but. Fingers crossed, you guys. I'll see you in five hours. Okay, a slight change of plans. I just got a hold of the car dealership and we found out that it is still available, but there's another girl who really wants it who's been talking to the guy at the car dealership about it for like a week now. And she's also coming in today and we live like over an hour away from Orange County. So I had to rinse the tan off after like 45 minutes. It still gave me a little bit of color. If I feel like I need more color, I'm just gonna put it on again later, but I had to rinse it off. I didn't wanna keep it on because the seats in this car are not black. So I didn't wanna ruin the seats immediately, but okay. Okay, time to go get the car. Fingers crossed she doesn't get there first. One hour later. I think we might be in luck with the car. Alex is on his way back right now. He should be here in like 10 minutes. And I am like 
I'm freaking out because I keep getting these emails. So we had three that could have potentially worked. One was sold. The other one said he wouldn't put it on hold because a girl was coming in today too and he said whoever gets here first wins and then the other one's in san diego but like if we get to orange county and it's sold then we might as well just keep driving to san diego and try and get the other one before it gets sold these have all been put on the market for less than 24 hours so they're really hard to find but i have boxes i have boxes i'm gonna do an unboxing to calm myself and stop like over like stop thinking about it because i'm i'm so like antsy i was supposed to be like working and filming today but i'm like no i need to get this car i need it Cute. have you guys ever tried the lip injections from Too faced i am obsessed and they sent more shades i have one in my bag right now i think it's just the clear kind though i really need a little makeup case for my bag this is the one i currently bring with me but I'm excited to try out all the other ones. You guys have been telling me recently that like my vlogs are calming and that's why you like to watch them. I'm so sorry this isn't that calming. I feel like it's not calming at all. Like typically I would never go for rhinestones on a swimsuit, but at sunset I feel like with golden hour, like in just the specific lighting, it could be really pretty. Oh cute. Love a good little like mesh cover up shirt thing. Alex is in no rush and he has no idea. Okay, hey, I just left it out, so I'm on my way back. Hurry! I'll be done 15, starting now. That's I got myself one of those, like, towel wrap things because, like, you know, the things that are, like, a tube top but a towel because apparently, like, I should be doing my skincare routine all down my neck and decolletage area, which I knew, but I got really lazy about it, and I, typically if I'm, like, wearing a robe or, like, a sweatshirt, I just won't do it, and so I'm really trying to take care of myself and my skin. So I got one, Amazon. This one is from Naked Wolf. Keep in mind, I think whatever they sent me, I got it for Coachella, so over a month ago. I don't know if I'm gonna have anywhere to wear these. We'll see what they sent. Oh shoot, I'm definitely not gonna have anywhere to wear these. No, they just came in a month too late. Look at how fun though. Save them for next year. How intense are these? Like. This would have been really cute. Yeah, there's absolutely nowhere to wear these right now. Oh, I might as well show you guys my outfit while we're waiting for him. I forget the name of the brand, but I'm gonna check the tag and I'm gonna link it in the description. This, I also forget the name of the brand, but I'm gonna check and I'm gonna link it in the description. How cute is this flower hair clip? It comes in like a set of nine with all the different colors and it's only like 10 bucks on Amazon. We'll also link that and then these New Balance, and I'll link them too. Cute! It's so cute! Does it work good? What happened here? Yeah, I mean, there's definitely some nicks. Oops. Yeah, no. No, it's manual. Yeah. Is it manual? Yeah. Let's ask them. Let's ask them. Maybe it is. It's manual. No. But I like the sides like this. I'm not. T I'm not gonna tell you guys what car it is yet. Still can't find out. Yeah, yeah. Update, we didn't get that car and we uh, we drove halfway to San Diego, I would say, and then decided not to because we found another one that was like less, like just like a better version of what we're looking for. So now we are our in the opposite direction. Anyways. You're making us sound like idiots. <laughs> Alex, who cares? My phone, you guys remember how I put it in the washing machine last week? 
um, it won't turn on now and I have a feeling it's because of that because when I was charging it it was stuck at 1% for like 45 minutes and then immediately when I took it out and tried to switch chargers it just died so I don't know if and when this is gonna come back on we'll see but we're just setting where to go get some food right now and then we're gonna go into the next dealership and test out the next car I have a brain freeze. Freeze brain. I will make you see all of the things that you can be. Believe in yourself, come follow me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Two hours later. We didn't get a car. It's fine. I think we're just gonna use Carvana. You can return it within seven days if you don't like it on Carvana. Yeah, I think we're just gonna order it and pick it up on Monday, but I think we just need to get something for now. It's something as little as like the interior color is a little bit different than what I was hoping, but otherwise it's the exact car I want. So I don't even know why I'm so, I'm stressing over this, but you guys know I'm just like really particular. So yeah, I'm, I'm really excited. I wanna show you guys the results from my contour tanning thing yesterday. I don't look the most contoured, but like I look so sun-kissed and it's perfect. It's like not orange at all. I'm very happy with it. Um, I think I'm always going to do self-tanner with a makeup brush now because it came on so even. I'm obsessed. Anyways, me and Alex are going to um, have like an admin day at one hotel. I've never been, but Katia and Edun spent a lot of time there when they were in LA and they loved it. So we're going to go check it out. I have some very sad news. The next day, I don't think I turned on the camera at all yesterday because I needed to make some serious decisions about the car. And I know I wasn't gonna tell you guys about it. Like I was gonna reveal it at the end, but I think the entire thing, how was your call? Good. How was your call? How was it? It was good. Anyways, we were literally gonna go to Vegas yesterday to pick up the car. Oh yeah, let me tell you guys. The dream car that we were hunting down for the past few days was a VW Beetle convertible. Honestly, I wanted something before 2010 because that's when the models were the cutest in the early 2000s. But then we drove a 2008 and it felt like it could fall apart at any second. And we thought maybe that's because there's a lot of miles on it. So then we were gonna drive to San Diego to try out a 2004 model, which didn't have really any miles on it at all but we were just like mm, 2004 I feel like can't be good so then we found one a 2013 model and that's what we drove at the last dealership that we were at we really liked it but I really wanted to find a beige color and a blue color either one would have worked but apparently they stopped making the harvest moon beige color in like 2010 so that there was no way I was gonna find it so then I was like okay let's let's just get the white convertible one but let's try and find a more recent year so we don't have to worry about it breaking down so we found a 2018 white convertible in Vegas and we were literally gonna fly to Vegas and then we realized that the interest rates for first-time car buyers are like twice as high and then plus also like having to go to Vegas and also having to worry about an old car breaking down and buying it and not leasing it. The payments would have been like the exact amount of buying a Range Rover, literally, you guys. I don't know why bug cars or like, I guess used cars right now, it's like the worst time ever to buy a used car because of, I don't know, I'm not like an expert on car finances or anything, but it's, it's, it's a bad time to get a used car, basically. So now, Today we're gonna go to the Land Rover and Jaguar dealership because you can get a Jaguar, Jaguar, is that how you say it? For the same price as a bug car, so who would have thought? I don't know, I've never been a car person and like honestly when Alex said he was gonna get the car, I was like, that's fine, I don't care. And then it hit me and I was like, we, we could get a bug. And ever since getting excited about the bug, I've wanted to like have a say in the car. So I'm like kind of annoying. That's my rant for this morning. Okay, I'm gonna go edit now. Three hours later. Can you move it along? I'm all out of time, cars. We're going to drive more cars. Also, I'm about to post some of my stories. Jamie, my best friend Jamie, you know, Jamie Alex, handle Instagram profile right here. She's looking for an assistant based in LA. So if you're interested, you can DM me or DM her. Either one works. If you're interested. Woo! All right, see you guys at the dealership. There it is. What'd you think? I liked it. Okay. 
I really That's liked it. it. No, no, no. I really, really liked it. Like, I mean, it's just, it's luxury. It's luxury. Like, I needed to know if I could parallel park, and I wasn't going to try and do that with him in the car. Well, you can parallel park. I've ne- But, babe, there's a camera. It- We're going to okay. talk this over, guys. Talk I'll it keep over. you posted. Let's talk it over. You guys, they're helping me make my car decision on live. It's 2018, but I just, I, here's the thing. It's not old, but I'm sick of driving a sedan. I really want an SUV because it's a safety thing. Like I just feel safer in a bigger car. If I had one word to describe Lexi, I think it would be chaotic. <laughs> yeah, chaotic. I'm going to do something so exciting today, but I'm running a bit behind. Okay, while well, I let my hair sit. We're going to Vegas. Well, so I just finished packing. I am so excited to go to Vegas and it's not for the reasons that you guys think I'm going to Vegas. Nobody really goes to Vegas for what I'm going to Vegas for. Yeah, yeah. We're in Vegas not to party, not to get married, even though when I posted on my stories, everybody thinks we're eloping. We're not. We're here to get our dream car. My dream car. <laughs> in my heart, I decided to go with what my heart wanted and that was the smartest because even though it's a terrible time to buy a car right now, like I just need to do something fun for myself and that's something that's like smart for the long term because I have the whole rest of my life to be like practical and smart and like think long term and like probably one day when I'm a mom or whatever, I'm gonna need a big car. So anyway, Anyways, if I didn't already spoil it, we're getting a convertible bug car. I'm gonna be practical and mature with the color choice. So we're going with white, with a black interior. And we're gonna go see it now at the dealership. We went all the way to Vegas for this because you guys, like they're impossible to find. It's impossible to find a convertible one in LA especially. I will make it work. I didn't even bring a full suitcase to Vegas. And I thought, you know what, if anything, when we do road trips and stuff, the less clothes I can bring, then the less outfits I'll feel pressured to shoot. So then hopefully the more I'll slow down and have fun and like actually enjoy myself. Okay, I'll see you guys at the dealership. So come and run away. We had all these plans, meet up with some old friends, and go out, and then when we got stuck at the dealership until 10 p.m. doing who knows what, then we missed dinner. Then we ordered Postmates, hoping to meet up with friends at 11 p.m. You know, like get back, eat the Postmates, change, and go out. And then the Postmates or somebody stole the food. Then we have not had like any food today. So now it's 11:30 at night and we're going down to the lobby to get pizza and just call it a night. Alex made a good point. We came here to get a bug car. We did not come here to party and we got the bug car, so mission accomplished. And so we're gonna get pizza and have a glass of wine. We're leaving Vegas. Honestly, I don't think Vegas is for me. This is the fit. You guys, I love this Chanel beach bag. Top is Princess Polly. Jeans are Revolve. Same gym shoes as yesterday. Bye Vegas. Actually, no, we're not done in Vegas yet. Bye MGM, thank God. <laughs> She's so cute! I'm dead. Put the top down! So masculine. You guys, I lied. If I stayed here, I think I would like Vegas. I'm obsessed with Caesars Palace. Yeah, I'm 100% staying here if I ever come back to Vegas. Vegas is like Epcot. They've got like a Paris, they've got an Italy. Or is this Rome or Athens, Greece? I don't know. They've got a Paris, they've got Caesars Palace. Let's call it. They have a New York and a medieval time. The following Thursday. Hey, please don't hit my car. <laughs> Wait, did you even map where you're going? No. Okay. So I just don't want to like drive it backing out. So which is what you're doing right now. I know. I leave for one day. <laughs> Lexi goes to Vegas and buys a convertible. Like, I'm not mad about it. It's almost more stressful when you drive. Imagine that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, like, wait, you're supposed to turn there. <laughs> okay. Which uh, way? Yeah, continue straight for 50 feet and then go to the 101 north. Wait, I've what? literally never gone on it's the highway I'm before. Here. I've literally, okay, wait. I just drove all the way here on the highway. There's no one on the highway. We're gonna learn. I need a map or here. something. I'm not gonna fit like. <laughs> you have one, but I don't know why it's showing up like that. Ever it's since supposed I to be in. on there. Go straight. Okay, here we go. Oh here my God. Okay. Oh, so good. When do I get on? It's literally going 40 miles per hour on the highway. It's fine. <laughs> oh my god! 
No, no, you can't put it up while oh. we're driving. Okay. okay. While we're moving. Uh, which way? Uh, you're going left. Park, put the car in park and just put it up really fast. Okay, I really, That was a cool range over. That was like Trisha Paytas or something. And she honked at me. Oh my god, a bug. I'm scared it's gonna get totaled. Okay. Don't say that. Okay. Stop saying that. Because my family keeps telling okay, me. Okay, but that. stop okay, saying that. Do you have to film today? Um, well, can I ask you what it says? Can I have to submit uh, my pet tummy? Are those my car keys? Oh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs>